Young Link's biggest weakness, like, it almost feels like this character has everything, but the recovery, definitely not there. Horrible recovery. And even some of the ledge options, I was, uh, yeah. I think, I think Zan was talking to me about, like, some of the, like, basic ledge rolls and, like, get-up attack. Like, Young Link just has, like, really bad ones, like, frame Absolutely. Ones. Even sometimes, like, some of the standard... Uh, recovery gameplay for Young Link, like to hold on to Bomb, can absolutely mess up his recovery. He's going to get back to ledge, and then Bomb blows you up right into your opponent's hands, or something like that will happen. Right, right. Yeah, and a lot oh. of the shield Ooh. pressure, you know, that Young Link has as well, that is pretty safe, like some of these back airs. Ooh, the fade back. Um, not going to be really safe on block against Lucina, depending on how close you are. That, uh, you know, frame three up extremely powerful. Ooh. Gets the, gets the return on the boomerang. Doesn't convert, though. Wait a minute. Oh, it was an excellent air dodge there by Tyrant. Stayed out of dodge, but Taro still put on the pressure, trying to make Tyrants overthink it. Okay, is can it I do it? No, no not quite. Not quite. not enough. I feel like Kairos is, like, getting some of these hits, but just is is fading back, and because of that... Oh, no! It doesn't get the punish! You guys feel like it's got to be the product of just the mental warfare play against the likes oh, of Tyrants the and Aladdin, but oh! Kairos has made a beeline for Tyre Angels. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you pay for that. Ooh, that was nice. Oh. Nice little shuffle there. <laughs> okay, the ledge trap. I like the arrow from the corner as well. Um, you don't have to commit. No, unless your opponent's jumping out of the way, they're gonna get hit by that. Yeah. Gonna, you know, gonna take shield, just shield stun. And Kairos still just taking it very slow. Uh, I feel like with young links that some young links obviously like you're you're going to use your projectiles but it's like how do you use your projectiles right oh the double jump that there has so much lag just out of range there man that that is not a lot of range <laughs> no no <laughs> that's not what Kairos is looking for right now Ty tyrants he's starting to adjust his game plan a little bit for what Kairos is doing maybe like pace for pace he's trying to like ooh, oh man okay. he's keying in on something that Kairos is doing right now no double jump oh that down arc can be so unwise in so many situations, but basically save Youngling's ass and others. <laughs> oh yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's it's a big hitbox. There's there's lag, but it's it's nothing, it's nothing too crazy. Like you still gotta do it here and there just to you know, have your point respect. But hey, gonna close it out. Yeah. We talked about buffs. The buff to Youngling's uh, forward throw, giving him another kill option, was really key. Oh yeah, absolutely. And oh, oh no! Oh, Tyrant is so good at just fishing for those shield breaks. Yeah, and that gets Tyrants right back into this game. And yeah. I, I believe it was from a Beaver reverse as well. Okay, yeah, not going into the Dancing Blade, just going straight into the throw combo here. Scramble situation. Oh, excellent Tomahawk grab. Gonna keep Kairos up in the skies. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, gets his way out of the corner here. Kairos now is the one bullying Tyrants around. Yeah, Tyrants is just playing at such a great range. Um, just really yeah. utilizing, like, uh, you know, staying in the range of the sword, but not, you know, not getting tripped up too much by the projectiles as well. You have to be so prepared for just Lucina's drift and float at ledge, and Kairos was ready for it. Yeah, Lucina can definitely be frustrating. Like, the drift is so good, so floaty, so, you know, she's in the air for so long, can really just wait out a lot of options. But Kairos right now, all these projectiles are basically him saying, this is, you're on my time. You're on my time, man. <laughs> The boomerang covering oh. the dash grab lag. Tyranks trying to get back on the stage here. Goes back into the corner. Gets a parry. Oh. Okay. Oh. This off stage. Very dangerous for Kairos. Confirm off the bomb. Is it enough? Oh, he patiently waited out the counter. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Kairos with some next level galaxy brain thinking. Yeah, and like there was a decent amount of hang time on that too. So. Oh, he's going for the kill there right now. Not going to get punched for Until that whiff. This is, this is very scary. The, the full tank of rage here, the down air. And Kairos escape again. I Wow, the dodge. Oh, man. That was so good. I love the ledge drop, double jump arrow, and then directional air dodge in. Um, yeah. Obviously, you probably don't have to do that, like, depending, right? Kairos like, just basically paid for going vertical there towards the yeah, end, and Tyrant yeah. is able to escape and cover himself that back air off flat. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and I, I mean, Tyrant's just in general playing playing very horizontal. Um, obviously, both of these characters have great horizontal range. Uh, Young Link having a little bit more, but just a little bit more startup and stuff like that, right? Uh, and because Lucina is floaty, able to kind of like weave around in the air and just kind of pray and wait for the opening. 
And one, I mean, once Tyrant gets the opening, the, the offstage is so bad, it's really scary. There's only so much Paros can do, especially with the limited angling of some of his projectiles. You can cover like high recovery or just two ledge, but you know, especially with Lucina's up B, there's just no, nothing the Yellen can do about recovery low. Right, Kairos with an incredible lead here. Nice. The IN on the arrows are getting yeah. punished here. You love to see these frame traps from Paros too. Oh yeah. And you could do it at such a long range because of, you know, the fire arrow. The forward smash should not wow. Ooh, barely surviving. living. For now. <laughs> forward throw still not enough, but at this point you've taken so much damage. You have the rage online, but Ooh. Can you can you find an opening? You know, let's say like Tyrant had the temerity to think to to, to Z toss the bomb when he caught it off stage. Yeah. Okay. The Nair trying oh. to close it out here. Is this the start of the reversal? Possible? No. Yeah, there's like not going to be too many confirms online. Obviously here for Kairos, uh, a stray Nair. You know, forward throw definitely will do it. Any like stray area, we see the the Nair trying to come out here. You hope that these. Uh, Slight bomb miscalculation. Some Kairos aren't the sign of maybe overthinking it. Yeah, and I feel like this is where I feel like some inexperienced players can like really throw away some leads. Oh, okay, get the down tilt up tilt or down tilt into up air. Yeah, but yeah Kairos. Kairos, Kairos was like kind of committing in with the nair is really hard, right? Like you've already camped your opponent up to 170 percent. What's another 30, <laughs> right? Like at that point, you you. I just see so many players like fish too hard for the Yeah, show, you, you just know can't I mean? lose your nerve and just go for it and absolutely lose yourself in it. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Tyrants with the tech chase. Yep. And that's why, I mean, it, it, it's funny because recently they buffed Mart's sport or down tilt to have a bigger tipper hitbox, but realistically, you don't want tipper down tilt because you want tech <laughs> chases like that, right? Yeah. You know, um, having. Having those kinds of tech chases at like really late percents is actually a very powerful thing. It's not like necessarily a kill like confirm, but you know, I mean, just tech chases in general will always be good for setups. Oh, well, I, I think Harris maybe keying in on Tyrant's shield drop habits or his timings. That down there was a hard commit, and he just went for it and got got payday. Oh man, there's so many. Kairos is just he's getting these return boomerangs. The trade connects. But like, there's some of these return boomerangs are connecting, but he's not converting off them. Maybe right. just like doesn't believe in them, so to speak. Just really doesn't think they're gonna connect. Tries to get this early gimp. Oh, oh you saved him! No, no, no! <laughs> oh, no. And this very puts Tyrants in the blender with the up B, following up cleanly. Oh, I think that was a uh, was it near one F smash? I think that Tyrants was able to pull off right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. Near one into imagination. <laughs> Beautiful parry into the down tilt. You have so much range. Okay, gets the reverse. Ah. Still alive, though. Kairos utilizing all these projectiles. So it gets back on the stage safely. Oh, the that should be it. Oh! You went for it and paid for it. But you know what? With the stock lead, you still love to see that kind of aggression. For that, you know what? I, I still think that is the correct play. He didn't nail it, so to speak. But like in that situation, when your opponent goes for a greedy directional air dodge like that and you can punish it, like you should do but that. Don't look now, Charles, because Tyrant's is starting to play like he's in the driver's seat. Yeah, true, true. I mean, that after... Big dash attack, try to get double dash attack. Ooh. Look at all this control underneath the platform. What are you going to do? Paris has to get out of the air. He has to get out of the skies. Oh, late Nair. Oh, he went into the spot dodge, too. He didn't believe that the Nair was going to connect. Right. But still looking good damage-wise. Oh, again. With, like, the, just the, he's looking for the move after the move, and he keeps hitting the move. <gasps> oh, oh no. I ah, just do it. Every single game, I feel like, or especially that that game, it just felt like Kairos 